Welcome back. You're watching Morning Live. Thank you for staying with us. Now, in March 1971, one of the foremost avant-garde composers of the 20th century, Karl Heinz Stockhausen, visited Soweto, accompanied by black consciousness activist Steve Biko. Needless to say, there's little archival evidence of this meeting, what their conversation was, what were the topics they might have covered, maybe music, maybe politics. Now a now South African composer and sound artist Philip Miller has put together an imagined dialogue between the two leaders using a series of selected, fragmented archival sound recordings photographs and music. He has assembled some of the country's talented creators such as Tlale Makene and Sia Makuzeni to bring this project titled Bikohausen to life. Philip Miller and vocalist Vuzumuzi Ntlapo joins me now to talk about Bikohausen. Gentlemen, thank you very much for joining me. Thank you. Philip, I'm going to start with you. This is such a beautiful idea. I can't even begin to even understand where you start with an imaginary conversation between two icons. Yeah, I think in a way it was a crazy idea. Yeah, you <laughs> use that word crazy. crazy. Yeah. A crazy idea, but an idea that really for me came out of this thing of how do you connect this incredible radical thinker in music, mm -hmm. Stockhausen, but of course he was really very much from the European music tradition. And how do you imagine him meeting up one of the greatest rag radical activists and thinkers and revolutionary from our countries, Steve Biko. And you think to yourself, this has to be something was sparking between the two of them. And that spark made me think very much of how to bring a group of really creative collaborators around who I often work with, yeah. who can come with that kind of imagination, because in the end this work is about imagination and experimentation and to put us all together in a yeah. room, which is what I did, for six hours, Wazi Mwazi, Tlaile, Sia, Bamita Beni, Walda Alexander, and Messina, all of us came together, and these are people I've worked with for many years, so we have a, a way also, and let's literally together imagine this conversation, but through music and voice. Wow. Yeah. Let, me, let me bring in the Mr. Creative Collaborator here mm -hmm. into this conversation. So, Philip calls you and says, I've got this crazy idea, this is a radical idea. I want to imagine a conversation between two people that were uh, radical in their own way. Mm. And I want you then, as a creative, to weigh into that conversation. Mm. Where do you start? What is the, the ground for that formula? How do you even start tackling that conversation? Do you look at what the, some of the issues might have been that could have come up? Yeah. Well, I think firstly and foremostly, is a, as a creative, it tends to be easy sometimes. Hmm. But I think this was a new territory for me because you know you you, you, you couldn't prepare yourself. You know you it, the, the because you can't have yeah. a preconceived idea coming yeah. into this conversation. Yeah. You've got to be open to what Philip thinks. Yeah, of course. Yeah. yeah. So you, you you have to dig into yourself, into your creative spaces because I'm a writer as well, a composer. So I, I, I had to dig in, and, and I, I think I loved the, 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 the element of surprise because I've been uh, like, uh, more or less uh, um, involved with such a thing before. Okay. So I, I like sort of like dug back into, into that uh, space. So you, you don't really, really prepare, but you try to be in the moment and, and try to live in the experience and try to connect with whatever was happening in 1971. Uh, yeah, and then I, I think another thing is that, that the issue is quite close because, I mean, Stevie was one of the, yeah. for me, is a hero. You know, it's quite close as a black person to, to be part of that uh, mm. conversation and, and, and improvisation yeah. with, with other collaborators in the project. So, yeah. Improvisation means that you've got to allow everybody the space to have that. How robust was that yeah. conversation? Yeah. How creative was that session? Mm -hmm. And musically, what was that interpretation like? Yeah. Exactly. Improvisation, <coughs> I believe, also involves being playful. Yeah. Mm. And being able to say, if I make a mistake, it doesn't matter. We move yeah. on. Because this isn't something where you're saying you've got one chance and that's the only chance ever. It's about, we had six hours, okay, which was intense. <laughs> six <laughs> hours together. Was that purposely said, yeah. six hours? Yeah. It was li literally, it was like just a boot camp <laughs> for yeah. six yeah, hours. Yeah. We, we created ideas. Some were stronger than others. Mm. But what it did involve is a kind of, for each person, 
a feeling of what, what are these means? Because there were words of Steve Biko about the protest student movement then, 70, of course he had yeah. been 76, that was talking completely, in, we were doing this in September last year. It was talking to the... At the heart of what was happening with students. Yeah. 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 So, we, the role that you take now in, in Bikahausen, talk to me that very quickly. Come again? The role that you play in Bikahausen now. Or it's just to, to, to improvise, you know, we, we normally take, we take a few things, like be give, like be given some papers to, to improvise on, and maybe listen to some, yeah. you know, yeah, like a tape, yeah. and then we just uh, imp yeah. improvise from there. To add on, so we got these tapes, tapes of Stockhausen mm. speaking, actually, at the SABC here, SABC yeah. here in yeah. 71, and we used phrases from his talks, yeah. and then we took an interview, one of the last interviews of Steve Beaker, and we started to use those we, uh, we as, the thread. as the thread. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Uh, quickly, a little bit earlier I spoke to Ashraf Jardine about where work is sitting at the moment, where creatives are. Yeah. It's no longer in a silo. It's yeah. multidisciplinary. It's yeah. multisensory. Yeah. Yeah. This is the installation. What is it? Yeah, it's incredible. So they, I say incredible because I didn't make it. So I can really say it was an incredible thing. So we filmed three cameras in that boot camp workshop. Yeah. We filmed, we had three cameras filming. And we cut together from six hours. We cut it down to three. The amazing filmmaker, Catherine Myberg, who's worked in this kind of work. So you have three huge screens in a space coming at different angles all the time on the different singers. So you're all the time. You think Vizzy in one space, mm -hmm. thinking, suddenly coming up with an idea, then suddenly Suddenly, uh, Sia is responding to him. And this whole thing is cut into a big three-screen triptych, the fancy word. Yeah. And that is what you go in. And so, I mean, it's actually an installation. Go into a, a room and it's like a little movie for 40 minutes. And you sit there and you feel like you're in a workshop. Yeah. I think. Yeah. That's yeah. true. That's yeah. true. No. Okay, so this is exciting. Where can we where can we get it? Where can we watch it? Very quickly. Yeah. Well, Goethe Institute, who were incredible to get this thing happening and help us. At their Goethe... Uh, offices, which is in Parktown, Parkwood. Okay, it's on every day. You can go there any day from I think they open at ten. But on Sunday we have a really special event happening, okay. and we want everyone to come. It's really we're gonna mm. kind of re Sunday tomorrow, it. Sunday next week. It's tomorrow. tomorrow. Sunday tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow. tomorrow. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So we want absolutely everybody make your way there. Take friends. Go and have a conversation. It's a good place to be. Renowned South African composers, uh, sound artist Philip Miller speaking to us about uh, his capacity of the founder of Beekhausen, which is a multimedia installation about the late South African artist Steve uh, Bantu Biko and the influential German composer uh, Karl-Heinz Stockhausen, uh, Stockhausen. Along with him is vocalist, uh, creative collaborator, Zamuzi and Klapo. Go check it out. Okay.